at that. my language guys but that consistently between noon and six o'clock for the most part. Especially during the weekdays. The only downside is the process is that uh, when it only uh, of course is when will it go live. There's no guarantee on that. But anyways, the current time is 3.19, so uh, within the next 40 minutes, I'm going to have to start getting ready to go to work. I'm going to have to end this video and start getting ready to go to work. Unless you guys want me to go to 4.15, and I am willing to do that. through that. Which I kind of like the idea of. Sorry about that guys, but look at that green. Look at the green grass there. It is so cool. It looks so nice. Unfortunately, that causes my allergies to go up too. So soon I'm going to have to start going for that Zyrtec again. See how bad the water damage is. That's water damage up there? Why do you think that's why these ceilings are bowing in? That's water damage. Wow. Man. It's bad. It's even in the apartments the ceilings are bowing in. He coming.
Man, my little sister doesn't realize how smart dogs really are. Get over there. That surprised me. Okay, whatever that is, it's creepy. That thing is creepy. Whatever the heck it is. I'm not touching it. It looks like somebody just lost their, uh, just lost some flannel pants. But anyways, uh, what I wanted to talk about here, what I want to talk about here is this new TV of mine. As I mentioned before, manufacturers like to uh, underestimate what their uh, TV is capable of. My TV is capable of the high-end HD resolution. Not the 4K, guys, because that's ultra HD. Not HD. It's ultra high... My TV is high definition, not ultra high definition. It's capable, it'll handle both 720 and 1080. And the 1080 is the high end, high definition TV, high definition resolution. Sorry. Stumbling with my words here. It is in, it's not really a, a main, uh, it's not a super high brand, high end brand either. For whatever reason, the really high-end brands never seem to last me for more than a year or two. My uh, last TV, my uh, smart TV, was a Sharp TV. It was a uh, Sharp, and unfortunately it didn't last long. It started causing problems a year after I bought it. It wouldn't stop turning on and off. It just kept turning on and off over and over and over. On that last day that I tried to use it, it would not stop. It just kept going within a span of five minutes and I just decided, I just decided to, un, to turn it off, unplug it, and toss it out. So, that's what I did. The 43 inch smart TV is now gone. Kind of a relief if you ask me. And yes, my phone's still upstairs, by the way, in the apartment. As I said, I've got the screen recording active, so I can record my gaming on that now. Still le lots of leaves on the ground from the uh, fall of uh, 2018. Spring is definitely on the way, guys. It's coming. Hello, bald head. And dumbass. <laughs> we joke around with each other like that all the time. Apparently, a 
state and you have really long King Cobra tried to slither into somebody's house over in India. From our front door to the bathroom in our apartment. That's how long it was. That's not normal for a King Cobra to be that long. That's what you'd ex that's the length you'd expect a python to be. Pythons are the longest snakes in the world. But anyways, uh, I don't think I've showed you guys the uh, resolution my TV came from Let me show you. Playing right now. sister or a kid or a kid of your own. It's a, it's a common thing with girls her age. around 10 she's around 9 or 10 years old, old enough that she should at least know it'll, when to limit how often she plays around third graders all the way up to fifth grade when it comes to elementary school, no more recess. Sixth grade, no recess. Once you reach your third grade year, there's no more time. You no longer get to have your uh, what's called recess. That's how school works. She doesn't get. I don't. I don't think she gets that as well as she should, but. Uh, Not private prop. This is not our property. The damage. Whoever owns this complex owns this shed. cool stuff. Moss is actually, uh, there's nothing bad about it. Moss is basically a natural plant. It really adds to the beauty of nature. Hopefully, guys, you'll find me with a, uh, membership at this, uh, place I'm looking at. But right now, there's not much left of my A-line card. Let me 
have around 60 some odd dollars left. For now, I'll let you guys go. I playing with them a little bit while I was in there. Time is uh, quarter to four, so it's almost time for me to end the video here. It's almost time. So we still got time. by man. That's playing a part in this tiny house movement too. It's the nature that's being destroyed. keep you guys entertained. I'm going to have to end the video here. So uh, for those of you who enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe and don't forget to hit that notification bell. Peace out.